Alright guys, hey, how you doing? I hope you guys had a wonderful Thanksgiving. I hope you stuffed yourselves with turkey, dressing, and cranberry sauce. And I do hope that you got some really good deals on Black Friday. Unfortunately, there were no um, events that happened on Black Friday. So you can kind of say Black Friday was pretty normal for me. My Thanksgiving weekend was pretty good. But aside from that, I hope it was great for you guys. But I do have another product review for you. Today I am going to be reviewing this stuff here. This is the Cover FX Mattifying Primer with Anti-Acne Treatment. Okay? You can find this at Sephora. Well, Sephora stores. And you can also find this on Sephora's online store. Sephora.com. I'll put it in the description. But, um... You can find this over there. And I believe it is $38. Yeah. It's very expensive, but you can find over there for 38 bucks. This is what the tube itself looks like. Um, surprisingly, it's very popular because usually when I head over to a Sephora store, it's almost out of stock. It's usually almost always out of stock. So I was lucky enough to actually grab this stuff, and I've been using it ever since. Since here. There's nothing really special about it. I have oily skin and I wanted to walk around without my skin looking like I just ran a marathon and I'm sweating. Because usually if it looks like that, the um, excess oil tends to get into the creases and whatnot of my skin right now. And it makes me look a lot older than what I look. So, I picked this up and besides, people were saying that this was really good. So I've been using it ever since and I gotta tell you, if you do not have, if you have oily skin and you do not have this in your regimen, you need to get this, okay? Especially if you have oily skin or blemish prone skin and you like to wear makeup, okay? This product is phenomenal and I can see why so many people were raving about it, okay? And I can see why it was always out of stock because, well, <laughs> this stuff is nearly perfect for my skin, okay? I don't really wear makeup if you I don't know if I mentioned it in the um, what was it the bare minerals complexion rescue review which is like a really old video back when I was living in a dorm but um I'm not really big on makeup I prefer to wear mostly CC creams and tinted moisturizers because it's like one step and I'm done and plus I take care of my skin underneath it neath it so it's pretty much kind of even I don't know if the video can show you that but this stuff is nearly perfect, especially on days when I really don't want to wear a um, tinted moisturizer. I just want to go out and bare my face. So with this, it's pretty much like a little gel consistency. Yeah. You know what? I don't even know if the camera is picking this up, but um, I don't even know if the camera is picking this up. It smells pretty nice. It has a nice bitter smell to it and I think it's because of the stuff that's in it the ingredients that are in it here it doesn't list the ingredients on the actual bottle you might have to look on the box that it comes out in but the trick the trick to applying this especially if you have oily skin like me the trick to applying this apply this little bit at a time a little goes a long way because if you apply a whole bunch to your skin let's say um little drops little dabs the size of let's say a small pea like a small little pea the kind of peas you see on a dinner plate if you apply those to your skin to your skin if you apply too much to your skin it can have the opposite effect and it can make your skin oily now I've struggled with this before and I've, and I've applied this to my skin and there have been certain times where I've messed up on the application and Oh, great, wonderful. Okay, guys, hold on. All right, guys, I'm sorry about that. My brother just came, just came in, was coming to my door, and plus a very funny video had appeared. So that was what happened. But anyway, let's get back to the review. The trick to applying this is that you can't apply this um, in heavy quanti heavy quantities here. Okay, you have to apply this sparingly, especially if you have oily skin like me. Otherwise, it can have the opposite effect, and it can make your face very greasy. I've had this happen to me a few times, and really, it's not a good look, people. So just just be very careful when you apply this. Okay. Otherwise, this is wonderful. It leaves my face very matte. It doesn't um. 
it doesn't make my face it makes my face very shine free it's almost like a nice matte finish and I absolutely love the matte finish here because it just gives me a more natural look than some sort of glossy or um, dewy glow that I would usually get with the Bare Minerals Complexion Rescue speaking of that product by the way if you apply this this is a great product to match up with the Complexion Rescue I have actually paired this up with that product I still have it and I gotta tell you, it works. It keeps my face not only dewy, but nicely matte. It keeps my face very natural looking so that it looks like I'm wearing makeup, but in reality I'm just wearing this primer and the, t and the um, tinted hydrating gel cream on top. It is perfect for that, so I recommend pairing this up with a, um, with a Complexion Rescue from Bare Minerals or any other CC cream you might get, okay? Yeah. My only drawbacks are only two things here, and that would be the price. This is about 38 bucks, and it is very, very, very expensive. And as a college student like me, if I if I had still had a job, this wouldn't have been a problem. But because I lost my job, this is very hard to afford. And if somebody is on a budget, you might want to look for other alternative stuff. But this is really good. I recommend purchasing this when Cover FX has a sale going on. That's what I recommend. Otherwise, you'll have to pay the full price plus tax. And usually plus tax, it would equal, it would equal to about maybe 40 something dollars, which is very expensive. But um, the second thing is the bottle size. I really wish this was a bigger size, but I think the whole reason that they put this in a smaller size is because you, can, you just need to use it sparingly. And if you use it sparingly, a little will last you. A little goes a long way, like I said. So this bottle will last you a long time if you use it sparingly. But otherwise, this is a phenomenal product and I will be more than happy to try this again and I will be more than happy to keep this in my face regimen, okay? But like I said, you can find us at Sephora online or in an actual store. It's at $38. You can find it in the section that says Cover FX. It's usually sitting right next to the um, BB Gel Cream. Gel you know, Cream, by the way, is usually sitting right next to that. And I think it also might be sitting next to other primers there. They do have an anti-aging primer. Oh yeah, and before I forget, this stuff is really good at treating acne or treating any blemishes that might appear, on, appear in your face. Usually I would get blemishes at that time of the month, and usually when I would apply this, the blemishes would be significantly reduced by the next day. And then the day after that, they're nearly gone. So, oh yeah. I recommend getting this product if you have severe face problems here. here it doesn't tingle. Tingle, it's just... Yeah, I don't really want to talk anymore about this. You just have to include this in your regimen. It is a phenomenal product, and I can see why it is very popular in the Cover FX line. So, that's pretty much my review on it. If you have tried this before, let me know how it worked for you in the comments below. I would love to read them. If you have any questions about this product, leave them in the comments below, and I will answer them to the best of my ability here. And if you like my review, a thumbs up is appreciated here. Now, unfortunately, today is a wash day, which is why my hair looks a little funny on the camera here. So, after I get something to eat, I'm going to have to wash my hair because it's a little itchy somewhere in the crown area. So, I will see you in the next video here. More will be coming soon, soon when I get enough time. Right now, I'm working on a semester project. But I will see you in the next video, alright? See you later, guys.